Well, we begin this morning with a violent attack just before the start of the new year. Several NYPD officers apparently targeted by a man wielding a machete in Hell's Kitchen. Weekend today in New York's Miles Miller is live at Bellevue with what we've learned about that suspect and how the officers are doing, Miles. Yeah, those officers recovering here at Bellevue Hospital expected to make a full recovery and perhaps leave the hospital sometime today. We know the suspect is also here, and we know that the Joint Terrorism Task Force is investigating if this was a planned attack. A rookie cop working the New Year's Eve detail in Times Square, wounded by a machete-wielding 19-year-old. A nightmare scenario. Unprovoked, a 19-year-old male approached an officer and attempted to strike him over the head with a machete. The male then struck two additional officers in the head with the machete. One of the officers shooting the suspect identified as 19-year-old Trevor Bickford of Maine in the shoulder. Bickford and the cops rushed to Bellevue Hospital, where they're all expected to survive. The reason the Joint Terrorism Task Force gets involved in investigations like this is to ascertain what is the nature of the attack. Law enforcement officials say they're looking into whether Bickford had previously posted what they called jihadist writings online and travel to New York City to target police. In 2014, a radicalized man, Zale Thompson, attacked three officers without warning, nearly killing one of the officers. You got stabbed? And in June of 2020, a Brooklyn man stabbed an officer in the neck, stole his gun, and used it to fire at responding officers in another jihadist-inspired lone wolf attack. And investigators expected to execute search warrants this morning to figure out who this man is and why he carried out this attack. At Bellevue Hospital, I'm Miles Miller. Weekend Today in New York, back to you. Okay, Miles, thank you.